Hello, I am Lavinia Tudorake and in this video I am going to show you how speed prices for extras work. I have inserted a test product named Split Prices Extra and defined a price for bookings with departure in August and booking date beginning with the 20th of June until the 25th of July. Let's have a look on two bookings made in this period. The first one is made on the 20th of June and the second one is made today. For both of them I have chosen our test extra and we can observe that the price is 100. Let's now suppose that we want to sell the product this week with a different price. We can make this by using the new functionality of splitting prices. What we have to do? First, click this image button and the text box where we will insert the number of new prices will appear. In our case, we need to split the price in three. One price will be for the old bookings, bookings made before this week. The second price will be for the bookings that we will make this week. And the third price will cover the initial interval for booking dates. The first condition that the new prices must fulfill is that the inserted periods must perfectly cover the initial ones. For instance, we can either insert, if we press here 3, we can either insert here 1st of August and here 31st of August or we can split it in 3 let's say here 5th of August and then here we need to continue the second condition is that the periods must not overlap let's continue with our case here we will leave the departures interval as it was but we'll split the interval for booking dates. So, we will leave the price as it was for the bookings made before today. Insert a different price for this week. Here we'll have 100, let's say 80. And cover the initial bookings date interval. Here I will uh, intentionally insert a greater value so we can see the error message. Let's say uh, 28. I'll just insert a zero here. We should have an error message now. The new departure and booking intervals must match the initial period intervals. Here we must have 25 and now it should work. For the booking made today the price should uh, now be 80 Let's check if we refresh the page. So the price is changed now, 80. And of course that we can continue with this, we can now split this one for example in two and so on. I hope this video will be helpful for you.